Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Tonight, a matchup of teams at opposite ends of the division between the Altoona Curve and the Harrisburg Senators. Stepping in, Adrian Valerio, and we are set for baseball here this evening. Now the one and one pitch is swung on and missed one and that's strike two. Ball two. Weather shouldn't be much of a factor. 71 degrees here at game time. Here now the two two is swung on and missed strike three. Standing in Hunter Owen. One out nobody on. Hunter Owen. Almost got him to go around, but instead it's ball three. And he lays off here, ball four, and he'll become the game's first base runner here with one away. In now, Logan Hill. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. And he misses again, ball four. And that's back to back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Coming to the plate now, Guillermo Heredia. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. And the low 80s slider is in there, and he's in control one and two. Well, he's in a bit of hot water in this first inning, but if he can start throwing his slider effectively like that, he has a lot better chance of settling into this game. Two balls and two strikes now. Two two lofted in the air out toward right center. Chuck is over to his right as he puts this one away. Two down. Now batting Mitchell Tolman and he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Here's the two one. And he turns on this one and yanks it foul and back out of play. Hit to first. He's got it. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Into the box now, Andrew Stevenson. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Turned on, but it's wide at first and foul. Here now the 2-2. Doesn't get the zone. Count full now. Yasel Antuna waits on deck. Hit on the ground is short. Reined in. Throw on to first in time. One away. Now at the plate, Yasel Antuna. Here's one that misses inside, and the counts run full now. Three and two. And he missed with that one. It's ball four. A one-out walk here in the home first. Now at the plate, Drew Mendoza. First shot for him here. Two hits in five trips a night ago. Here now the 2-2. Popped high in the air. Jones shading to his right. And that's the second out of the inning. Next will be the cleanup hitter, K.J. Harrison. K.J. Harrison. The set and the 1-1 pitch. A swing and a ground ball to third. And a close play at second, but the throw does beat him, and the side is retired. Now in the box, Chris Sharp. The 
the 1 1. Is swung on and missed for strike number two. Well, he kind of struggled through that first inning, but ended up getting out of it. Now here in the second, you know he'd love to get this leadoff guy and get off on the right foot and maybe settle into this game a bit. Two and two the count. Now here's the pitch. Hit down the line at first. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at two and two. Here's the pitch. Grounder down the line at third. But a foul ball as it holds it two and two. Now here it comes. Swung on and missed. He didn't even come close to contact on a ball way out of the zone. One out. Into the box now. Christian Kelly. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. One and one. Here it is. Outside with the fastball as the count moves to two and one now. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. Well executed fastball right at the knees. Going to be a long day for this offense if he stays in that spot. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger and there are two away. The first baseman, Michael Jones. The 1-1 one -one home. Hit high and deep out to straightaway left. Left fielder looking up. And it's gone. Stepping in now, Sam Howard. Two and one. You certainly know he's not trying to work around the pitcher, but sometimes the hardest thing to do is to throw a strike to a guy that you know won't swing the bat. Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to three and one. And it's up to a three-two full count now. He was able to sneak that fastball by him on three and one, so so now we've got a battle on our hands. Lifted down the line and left. Left fielder giving chase. He makes the catch. What a play on the run to end the inning. Late Rhett Wiseman. He brings an average in the 260s into this one. The two and one on its way. That's ball three. He walked a guy back in the first, and now he's looking like he might hand out another free pass to the leadoff guy here. You can't be walking a guy in inning and think you're going to have any success. And he takes ball four. Leadoff good. man's aboard here to the begin the field. home half of the second. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. At the plate, Israel Pineda. First swings for him in this one with the runner still at first and one gone. Ground ball left side. And that's through into left field for a base hit. At the plate now, number 83. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Three and one now. Three and one here, you have to make a good pitch on the mound. Grooving one here rarely works in your favor unless the hitter tries to do too much with it. Full count, three and two. And now a slider in there for a called third strike, and there are two gone now. So striding in, Jonathan Hermann, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Now a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two. He's looking pretty passive here, hitting with a chance to drive it a run. Going to have to make something happen with two strikes now. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. 
34 pitches for him through an inning and two thirds right now. That's not terrible, but it's a lot higher than he'd like. The 2 2. Liner toward right center. Wiseman rounds the corner and is headed home. Pineda rounds third and is digging for the plate. And he will cross as well. And they've taken a two to one lead. Now that no Andrew. At the plate, Andrew Stevenson. In the dirt here. Runner holds as the count moves to two and one. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. It's clear he just hasn't been able to find any rhythm out there. Pretty much unable to hit any of his spots. And now he's at three and one, and he's put him into another great hitting count. Ready with the payoff pitch. Oh, got him looking at the two seamer, and that'll end it. Ready for another chance. Adrian Valerio, 0 for 1 here in the early going. Count is full. Here's the pitch. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Stevenson is there and he makes the catch for the out. Coming to the plate now, Hunter Owen. He drew a base on balls his first time up. A two to one score here as we play inning number three. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Swung on and missed, and it's even at two and two. And that misses, so it's a full count three and two. Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. Comes with a fastball, but it's outside for ball four. Ready now, Logan Hill reached base via the walk in his first play appearance. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Hey, he threw that pitch with a purpose to get a double play. Good job to let it go by, though, as a hitter. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. And he misses again here. It's ball four. And that's back-to-back -back walks here with one away. Had to bring in Guillermo Heredia now. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Liner in there for a base hit. Owen is on his way home. He will score. It's a 2-2 game. As he arrives at second without a play, as a run comes across to score on the play, tying the ball game. Into the box, Mitchell Tolman. Fly ball out toward left center field. Left fielder is on the move. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And he will beat the tag at the plate as he scores to make it a 3-2 game. Now batting. Stepping in, Chris Sharp. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Here's the 1-2. And he lays off it to even the count 2-2. Two and two. He's already walked two in this inning already. This guy just can't seem to find the strike zone. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. Heredia rounds the corner and is headed home. He'll score easily. And they now lead by two. Now batter. The catcher. Christian. In now, Christian Kelly. Kelly. A swing and a miss on a ball way outside the strike zone, and the inning is over. of the inning now and that'll bring up the switch hitting shortstop you sell Antuna 
Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. And that's the first down. So coming to the plate, Drew Mendoza. He popped out in his first trip. Yeah, I don't mind him trying to drive the ball in the air, but he can't collapse the backside, and that's exactly what he did in his last at bat. There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no-doubt home run. There's an old saying in the game. They say solo homers won't kill you. This might be a good time for a mound visit right here. Try and erase those negative thoughts and get right back in the zone. You still have the lead. Into the box now, K.J. Harrison. Up high, two and one now. I don't blame him for not coming over the heart of the plate. He circled this guy on the lineup card when he got to the yard today. He's been swinging one of the hotter bats in the game. Into the windup, here comes the 2 2 pitch. And he lost him here on 3 2 as that pitch misses. It's ball four. Striding in, Rhett Wiseman. He reached on a walk in his last time up and later came around to score. Runner goes for second, and it's fouled away. Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. Hit on the ground to third. To second for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Settling in now, Michael Jones as we begin the top of the fourth. And a good take there. Close, but it's two and two. Well, it's been a rough one so far. Four runs through three innings. It's about time to get that pitch count down, or he won't be out here very long. On a line, that's a base hit. And this will make its way to the 344 marker. The relay. But he'll be in there with a double. The pitcher, number 54, Dan Howard. Stepping in now, Sam Howard. And he pops up the bun attempt. And you can't ask for much more out of a pitcher than that. The sacrifice works to perfection. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Adrian Valerio. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. Grounded back up the middle. And that'll get by into center field for a base hit. Notch one in the score column as a runner from third crosses the plate. Now a 5-3 game. The third base point, number two. Hunter. To the plate now, Hunter Owen. Hit hard on the ground to second. And that'll just sneak past the glove, and it should be a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Kyle McGowan answers the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from the starter. At the plate now, Logan Hill. This one's flared off to the right side. Right fielder coming on. Oh, and he botches it. And they will hold that runner over at third as he'll move up only 90 feet, but the bases are loaded with one away. Yellow. Bases are loaded here with one away. And up next will be Guillermo Heredia. A 1-1. Valeria, the runner at third. Owen over at second. Hill at first, one gone. And a slider runs away from him there, and the count levels at 2-2. Two and two. What pitch recognition right there. 90% of the guys are going fishing after that nasty slider. Fouled away. Here now the 2-2. Just staying alive, putting together a really good at-bat here. The 
2 2 one more time. That's popped up. Harrison has room in foul territory, but this will land untouched. A swing, and he pops him up on the infield, and the infield fly rule will be in effect here. So digging in now, Mitchell Tolman. It was an RBI sack fly for him last time through. Yeah, he's going to have to earn his ribby this time up. Two outs, a little bit different. Can't just pop something out to an outfielder and steal an RBI. You're going to have to find some green grass. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. A one-two pitch. And this one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there, and the inning is over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And next will be a speed threat in the form of outfielder J.B. Shuck. The 2-2. This one's down to third. Fielded cleanly. And the throw stretches him out at first as the umpire says he stayed on the bag. A bang-bang play there for the first out. Digging in for his second at-bat, Israel Pineda. He reached on a single in his first try. The 1-1. Fly ball out toward left center field. Left fielder giving chase. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Number 83 comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. The 1-1. One -one. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Waiting on it is Aredia. And that's the third out. So striding forward now, Chris Sharp. He was a strikeout victim his first trip and then collected a base hit his last time around. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side. And that'll get down for a base hit. So the leadoff man is aboard to start out the inning. Now back. The Throw over to the bag. And the runner back easily. At the plate, Christian Kelly. Hard hit ball to second. That's through, and he's got his first base hit. He's one for three. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Into the box, Michael Jones. No contact there, and it's one and two. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Sam Howard. He laid down a sacrifice bunt in his last trip. And not easy to do in today's game. High velocity, exploding breaking stuff. He executed that sack bunt perfectly. One and two now. And now a two-strike bunt attempt here as this one's down. The second for one. And the relay won't nearly be in time as he's there easily. Now with the plate, Adrian Valerio. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. Smoked on the ground up the middle. And that'll get through into center field for a base hit. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run from third is in to score. The third baseman, number two, Hunter Owen. Standing in now, Hunter Owen. And he got him. Minimizing the damage at just a run. The inning is over. Two and two. Two and three. And a slider runs in on him as he has to lean out of the way. 
You could pretty much book it that a fastball's coming. A challenge fastball right here. He cannot allow the nine-hole hitter to get on base with the top of the order. The next 3-2. And that misses ball four now. It's a leadoff walk to get the home half of the fifth underway. Now battle. Back to the top of the lineup, Andrew. stepping in, Andrew Stevenson. He was sent packing on strikes in his last trip. Yeah, Maddie, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. And this will find the wall deep in the corner. Now the relay home, and he will score ahead of the play, and that will close the gap to two. It's six to four now. Now that is hooked up. So now to the plate, you sell Antuna, and that's outside. He lost him ball four. Miguel Del Pozo comes on now in an awfully difficult situation as there are two on here with nobody out. Drew Mendoza will be his first test out of the bullpen, and it'll be a tough test indeed as he'll face him with two on and nobody out here. The one-two. High in the air out to center field. Waiting on it is Aredia. He makes the play. Runner tags and hits for third. The tag, and they got him at third. It's a double play. So here's the cleanup hitter, KJ Harrison. The first base Runner on first with two away. Harrison. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Left fielder giving chase. He can't get there, so the inning will continue. And Tuna rounds third and is digging for the plate. And he's safe at the plate as it's now a one-run ball game. Into the box now, Rick Wiseman. And he fouls this one off. Swung on, but fouled off to the left. He was looking for a swing and a miss breaker right there, but left that one in the zone that got fouled off. Shatters the bat as this is hit on the ground. Off balance throw, gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Ryan Brindley takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 61. Royer. Top half of the sixth about Royer. to get started. And next to bat will be the outfielder, Logan Hill. Here it comes on one and one. Bonnie oh. gets him to wave at that one. It's two and two. Ball three. Three and two now. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. Scooped up. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Guillermo Heredia. He got under one and popped out his last time up. The 2-1. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. Bases are empty. One man out. Still two and two. A doubled up on breaking balls there outside. Now might be the time to bust that fastball in. And this is swung out and missed. So it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. Now batter. Stepping up now, Mitchell Tolman. He Mitchell struck out swinging in his Tolman. last trip to the plate. And you can live with punching out with the bases empty, but in his last... High drive deep down the left field line. And that is off the wall, but in foul territory. Foul ball. Rounded softly down the line toward first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Bottom of the sixth inning now, and that'll bring up the outfielder, J.B. Shuck. Now the three and two pitch. Right side, reined in. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow! 
Stepping into the box, Israel Pineda. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Change up just off the black, and it's two and one. Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to three and one. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. There's ball four. Digging in, number 83. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Lifted in the air out to center field. Waiting on it is Aredia. He's got it, and there are two down now. Adderley Ruiz will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. And this is hit hard to the right side, but foul. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. Hit the other way out toward right field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Andrew Isler is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 28. Andrew. Seventh inning ready to roll, and standing in the outfielder, Chris Sharp. Yanked the slider across that time, laid off for a ball. Fastball, and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Skied into straightaway right. Chuck is there to put it away for route number one. Now Stepping into the Kelly. box, Christian, Christian Kelly. Kelly. The 2-2 two -two is swung on and missed strike three. Digging in now, Michael Jones. So far, two for three in this one. No. Looked like he got fooled on the speed there. Two and two. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. The three two pitch is a swing and a miss. That's strike three. Shea Murray will come on now and he'll slide into the seven spot in the lineup following the double switch. Arden Pabst is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. Number 84, Arden Pabst. 3-1. Down by a run, your guy needs to get on any way he can. His mentality has to be to shrink the strike zone to like the size of the suit can. No reason to swing at a pitcher's pitch. And this is taken in just shy of the warning track for route number one. Digging in, you sell Antuna as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. One of the things this guy would like to do from the left side is swing it a little bit better against right-handed pitching. This guy has decent numbers, but not great numbers against right-handed pitchers. Got him swinging on the fastball there. Gisele Antuna becomes the second out of the bottom of the seventh. Wow, and he took something off of it there. It's one and two. One pitch away from wrapping up a very good innings work out of the bullpen here. Popped him up. Into the stands. He got it. Oh, 
Into the box. Arden Pabst. And he's getting his first plate appearance here in the eighth after entering off the bench just a little bit ago. The one two. Now a swing and he pops him up right up the chute. This may be tough behind the plate. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. Striding in once again, Adrian Valerio. Two hits in four attempts to this point. The 2-1 home doesn't hit the target. It's ball three. Hunter Owen is on deck. Line to second where it's caught there for out number two. The third base. Digging in to try it again. Hunter Owen, a hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. And a slider swung on and missed, and the side is retired. Joel Caesar is on the pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 38. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. And next to bat will be the first baseman, K.J. Harrison. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. The one and two pitch. Here's a fastball in on the fist, and that'll even things up at two and two. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. Now At the plate, Rhett Wiseman. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back-to-back -back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. James Bork enters from the pen to start the ninth inning as he'll try to keep the score right where it is heading to the bottom of the ninth. Stepping up to the plate, Logan Hill. He's 0 for 2 with a couple of walks in this one. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and there's the first out here in the ninth. So stepping in, Guillermo Heredia. He went down on strikes last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. One run game here in the top of the ninth. Hit in the air down the right field line. Right fielder is on the run, and no one will track it down. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Drilled to the right side. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. Now that second baseman, Mitchell Tolman. Stepping in now, Mitchell Tolman down the first baseline but a foul ball one and two the count now oh, and you can tell he wanted to hold off but he swings through the inside pitch anyway and he becomes out number two digging in once again Chris Sharp on the night he's two for four with a pair of singles here's the one and one pitch Two balls, two strikes. Now 
Count of three. Good two. spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. From the belt. Kicks and deals. Count still full. Three and two. Fouled off. This pitch misses for ball four. So that's going to move a runner into scoring position now with two away. Charlie Tilson will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. And able to lay off the fastball the way here. Two and one now. Has to be a challenge pitch coming up here. He probably doesn't want to flirt with loading the bases. Swing and a liner. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Jeff Hartley is the man called on to close this one and earn a save in the ninth. Number 32. All set for the bottom of the ninth. And now it'll be the catcher, Israel Pineda. Swing and a miss, and that'll get a groan from the home supporters here. One away. Digging in, number 83. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Fouled off wide at first, but boy, that had some zip on it. Grounded up the first baseline. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Alec Keller will pinch hit here, and he's the potential tying run. Number nine, Alec Keller. Fans on their feet in a one-run ball game in the last of the ninth. Taking called strike two, and now they're down to their final strike tonight. And it's fouled away. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. Lifted down the line in left. And this will wind up a foul ball. Here he comes again. One, two. And this runs inside. And that looked like it got him pretty good. Now to the plate, Andrew Stevenson. He'll be looking for something he could drive into the gap and drive home that time run from first. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And he struck him out for out number three. So that'll wrap things up here as they leave the possible tying run stranded at first. Yeah, and in this game, you always try to find a way to be hopeful. They win the first game of a new month and are now looking to keep it rolling the rest of the way. And tonight's one-run game comes to an end 6-5 to five, the final. Altoona led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Miguel Del Pozo earns the victory out of the bullpen his fifth. Jonathan Herman couldn't escape the fourth inning as he slapped with the loss. Jeff Hartley wraps it up for the save his 14th. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com. Our final line score, first for the victorious curve, six runs, ten hits. No error as they left 10 men on base. For the Senators, five runs on five hits. One error as they left six men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 28 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this evening.